Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's Mike here at Game from Scratch, and we have a new humble bundle of interested game developers, or more specifically, developers, or to be even more specific, programmers. Now, this one has a kind of dumb name, and that it's called the Learn to Code the Fun Way by No Starch Press Bundle. And uh, it's a collection of ebooks around the topics of programming. Pretty straightforward on the whole, and it kind of boils down to the way a typical humble bundle works. If there is a single book in this entire bundle that looks like it's worthwhile to you, it's generally cheaper than buying the entire bundle. So you get everything there for less than the cost of buying a single one of these books, as we will see in some detail. Now, this is a collection of books from No Starch Press. If you don't know how Humble Bundle works, it's organized into tiers or around the topic of stuff. In this case, it's eBooks around the programming language options. Uh, you buy a tier, you get all the stuff from the tier value below it. You decide how your money is allocated between Humble, Charity, uh, the publisher, and if you so choose, and thanks so much if you do, to help support Game From Scratch. So this one, again, broken down into tiers at the $1 tier, and they normally do this in such a way that the stuff that you really want, it's gonna be at the $15 tier. That's always how it works. But this one's actually pretty well spread out. So we've got the book, Think Like a Programmer, Pearl One-Liners, the book of F Sharp, Learn Java the Easy Way, Codecraft, the practice of writing excellent code, and finally, learn you a Haskell for great good, which I have to say, in the topic of learn to code the fun way, the only book here with a fun title is Haskell so far. And even then, it's kind of a dumb title, to be honest. But we got here... Um, a couple of generalistic books, and then Java, F Sharp, Perl, and Haskell. Pretty good spectrum of languages being covered for the $1 tier. Now, we jump into the next tier, $10.50 Canadian. That's, uh, I bet you, $8 US. Uh, we get Closure for the Brave and True. I guess that's a fun title. The Land of Lisp. Hey, that's a fun-looking cover, at least. Learn You Some Erlang for Great Good. Okay, we got a fun title there. And then we've got Practical Sequel, The Book of R, The Art of R Programming, and Impractical Python Projects. So, so we got Python now, Erlang, Lisp, Clojure, and then two books on R. R is mostly used for statistic uh, calculations and the such like that. And then one book in here for SQL as well. So that's at the $8 tier. And then we go to the final and $15 tier here. You're going to see The Secret Life of Programming is Understanding Computers uh, Craft Better Code. Uh, the Rust programming language. This used to be available for free in some formats. I don't know if it was the previous version or what, but I didn't find it again this time when I looked. Uh, the C++ Crash Course, which I think is where a lot of people are going to be interested. If there's a book that they want, it'll probably be one of these two. Either the C++ Crash Course or for some strange people out there that really like to punish themselves, the Art of Assembly Language 2nd Edition. Uh, finally, we have the Eloquent JavaScript 3rd Edition, a modern introduction to programming. And finally, Finally, and I'm going to probably check this one out because it's an amusing title, If Hemingway Wrote JavaScript. All right, so that is it. That is how the bundle breaks down. Pretty straightforward on the whole. No Starch Press generally are pretty good books. Now, one thing to be aware of, uh, they have featured pretty heavily in previous bundles. Uh, so I'm going to show you how to go ahead and check to see if you've got any of these books already. Now, as it goes with any of these things, I always buy the bundle, let you know what you're going to get. In this particular case, what you're going to get in every case except for the one book, oddly enough, uh, you get PDF, EPUB, and mobile formats. That means you can load these things up on your Kindle or your Nook or your iPad or in the browser or whatever. The nice thing here is uh, any book you're interested in, so we're on the Humble site right now, uh, they, they download basically instantly. So anything you want to check out, just boom, you can get it there. So the nice thing is you can basically use Humble as your bookshelf of choice. If you wish, just go back and download things as you want them. I don't know why this one doesn't have a Mobi version available, probably because it was the one that I was probably most interested in checking out. Uh, but as you can see, pretty much regardless to what kind of device you've got, you've got the materials here. Interestingly, there's no supplemental downloads for any of these books in this particular case. Um, now, as I mentioned earlier on, there is a lot of duplication for no starch stuff. Now, granted, I, I buy so many Humble Bundles. This is more of a problem for me than for most people. But what you should do is come into Humble Bundle and go to your library. You find it there. And then just basically search for no starch. Just make sure that the book you are looking for is not going to show in this case if it's a duplicate because I bought this bundle already. But you'll see. I have a lot of no starch books. Just want to make sure that some of the books in here you don't already have. I know for a fact that the, um, I think this book was already in here. I think the, uh, the Rust programming book was in a previous one, but the ones that are really kind of jumping out to me, this is one I think most people are going to be interested in. I don't think it was in a previous bundle. And as a C++ crash course, now, as I mentioned earlier on, the way it works is if you want a single book from a bundle, it justifies the entire cost. So for example, this C++ crash course, it is $38.22. And I think that's US, uh, Amazon dot, yep, com. So 
almost 40 bucks for the Kindle version of it. In this case, you're getting it for 15 uh, along with everything else. So as always, they really do structure it so that it's top loaded. Now, interestingly enough, though, they've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven books here. And they've only got six at the top tier. Normally, they also put the most books in the top tier. But again, I think the ones that are really going to jump out to people are this book, this book, and this book. Uh, but I could be wrong. This one could also be interesting as well. Uh, JavaScript books, you can do a lot of really bad things in JavaScript. So it's one of those things where actually having a good book as opposed to just you know an internet tutorial can be a really good idea. And again, generally, I find No Starch Press stuff is pretty good. But I also have to warn you, if you are interested mostly in the Rust program, language book. I'm pretty sure you can get that one for free somewhere else, but uh, I'm not going to be quoted on that one. So let me know what you think of this bundle in general, anything there that you really like it. What do you think of No Starch Press also? So that's it. Uh, again, not a whole lot of fun in this particular bundle, but there is a lot of pretty solid books on quite a few different languages. We've got, let's see, Perl, F Sharp, um, Haskell, Lisp, Clojure, R, Python, C++, Rust, assembly language, and JavaScript all covered here. Pretty good broad, broad spectrum of languages to, to get there. So let me know what you think. Talk to you all later. Goodbye.